We have been following Chris Field's work for quite some time. He's been a customer of ours. And recently he was comparing not only our system, but other motion control systems um, that are out on the market and also stuff that he's built trying to achieve these ultra macro shots of 10 times to 20 time magnifications uh, where he's doing multi keyframe shots of cells forming and other things on a cellular level, which is pretty difficult to achieve. So I reached out to Chris and wanted to see if he'd be willing to work with us on trying to build a motion control head that could achieve this level of precision that he was wanting. And so that is where we decided that we were going to start down the path of developing the Cine Shooter Macro. I've been getting a lot of requests to film macro and microscopic type subjects, anywhere from 1 to 1 to 5 to 1 to 16 to 1, even 20 to 1 magnification. Um, and in order to do that, I've got several different systems that I might employ. Some are off the shelf, some of them are home built systems, uh, depending on the needs of the shoot in order to accomplish this. However, it, the, nothing really seemed to be ideal. It's always been a bit of a struggle. I was posting quite a bit of footage on Facebook and on Instagram when uh, Kessler Crane reached out to me. Eric said he had a brand new version of the Cine Shooter, and this one was built around accuracy and high levels of uh, movement resolution. And the ask is I would take one of these systems and I'd work with it and work with Kessler in order to ensure that this is going to be something that really does fit the needs of uh, what I'm doing. So over the course of the next few weeks, we went from something that was a little bit clunky to something that actually got really smooth and was able to get me into levels I've never been able to do before. So the reason I really like this machine is in the past I'd have to take different types of systems uh, that were good at some things and good at others uh, and try to piece it together in order to accomplish these style of shoots. However, now I'm able to not only get them with the same machine, um, it also allows me to be able to do A to B keyframing at macro levels all the way down to uh, 10 to 20 times. So it's really been amazing what I've been able to get with it. The original Cine Shooter was developed for high speed, and low noise applications, as well as just the everyday uh, shooting that the film industry requires. Chris Fields needed something that was extremely high resolution, and he's dealing usually within millimeters. So we changed the gear ratio, up the resolution of the encoders for his type of applications. We also have other customers that were needing high strength uh, capabilities, and that was a natural attribute of going with the lower gear ratio that's in this system. So after spending several months working with this system and using it professionally, I tell you what, it has absolutely impressed me. There's no other system out on the market I've been able to find that's able to get me to do this kind of keyframing and this kind of motion control at this level. It's just nothing quite like it. So, you know, this is something definitely to keep in mind. If you're shopping for a motion control system and you need that ultimate level of accuracy, uh, you just can't do better than this. We're doing a lot of new exciting things with motion control. Technology is changing. We're applying new components. Uh, we're always looking forward to doing the next great thing. And we have a lot in the works currently that we're excited to get out throughout this next year.